Consuetudo, or custom, was a word with many meanings during the Middle Ages, and it was frequently used to make distinctions with other types of law and of other legal terms. Before circa 1150, the word often had one of two senses. First, it referred to unwritten and or non-enacted law, and was thus contrasted with written and or enacted law, lex. Second, it meant exaction, and was associated with the exactions or the customs that lords demanded from those under their authority. This second sense became very prevalent from circa 1000 onwards. After the rediscovery of Roman law, consuetudo acquired a particular resonance amongst jurists as authors attempted to fit customary law, based on consuetudo, into the emerging Romano-canonical law. A key issue for jurists was the authority that an unwritten custom had in relation to the written content of civil and canon law. The solution adopted by some was that the validity of any particular customary rule rested on two components. First, it needed the consensus of those subjects to its provisions, and second, it had to be proven, meaning that individuals who claimed the validity of any particular custom needed to show that an earlier court decision had applied the same customary rule. Medieval thinkers and modern historians have thus seen a close relationship between custom, court practice, and ideas of precedent.